Turn me up when this come on You writing this story, let me give you all the glory You might be my favorite song Turn you up when this come on You gave your life for me, let me give you all the glory Chasing you with a shot of Henny Say it's Gucci, but you get a Fendi I can count the ways, you deserve the praise Honestly, there is too many All I'm seeing is confetti Vision on 2020 Got plenty of reasons to keep on believing You the gift that God sent me we can't know the ending if we never turn the page We don't know the future, let's just take it day by day I'm not really worried about tomorrow anyway No, we can't predict our fate, but tonight we celebrate Let's celebrate, it's time to celebrate We all know we did something great, yeah Let's celebrate, time to celebrate Turn me up when it's come on You ride in this story, let me give you all the glory You might be my favorite song Turn you up when it's come on You gave your life for me, let me give you all the glory Glasses in the air, let's make a toast Put the light inside me, that's the Holy Ghost You still love me at my worst You bring heaven down to earth Raise your glass in the air, let's make a toast can't know the ending if we never turn a page We don't know the future, let's just take it day by day I'm not really worried about tomorrow anyway No, we can't predict our fate, but tonight we celebrate Let's celebrate, it's time to celebrate We all know we did something great, yeah Let's celebrate, time to celebrate Turn me up when it's come on You ride in this story, let me give you all the glory You might be my favorite song Turn you up when it's come on You gave your life for me, let me give you all the glory But you get offended. I can count the ways you deserve the praise. Honestly, there is too many. All I'm seeing is confetti. Vision on 2020. Got plenty of reasons to keep on believing. You the gift that God sent me. We can't know the ending if we never turn the page. We don't know the future. Let's just take it day by day. I'm not really worried about tomorrow anyway. No, we can't predict our fate. But tonight we celebrate. Let's celebrate. celebrate, celebrate. It's time to celebrate. Celebrate, celebrate, celebrate. We all know we did something great, yeah. Let's celebrate. Time to celebrate. You would say this your favorite song. Turn me up when it's come on. You ride in this story. Let me give you all the glory. You might be my favorite song. Turn you up when it's come on. You gave your life for me. Let me give you all the glory. Glasses in the air. Let's make it toast. Put the light inside me, that's the Holy Ghost You still love me at my worst You bring heaven down to earth Raise your glass in the air, let's make a toast We can't know the ending if we never turn a page We don't know the future, let's just take it day by day I'm not really worried about tomorrow anyway No, we can't predict our fate But tonight we celebrate, let's celebrate 
Hello, my name is Brittany with Club Pilates. Today's workout is going to be a 30 minute lower body workout. We don't need any weights, we don't need any props, just your own body weight today. We're gonna burn out those legs, all right? Let's get started. We're gonna take it right down to your mat to get started here today. So go ahead and lie down, get comfy. We are starting with some bridging to wake up that backside of the body. So bend those knees up to the ceiling. Plant your feet on the floor, hip width apart. Kind of spread those toes apart. Give yourself a nice strong base. Press the arms down into your sides. From here, we're gonna slowly tuck the hips under, peel up through the spine, rolling your hips up into a bridge position. Good, long diagonal line through that side of the body. Slowly melt back down through the spine, one vertebra at a time. Good, inhale at the bottom. Axle again, tilt the pelvis under, peel on up. Rolling through the spine, stretch the front of the hips. Inhale. Exhale, slowly melt back down. Good, we're gonna take that a couple more times. This right here is just kind of waking up that back side of the body as I mentioned here, firing up those glutes, those hamstrings. Also getting a little bit of stretch, the front of the hips as well. Good, we're gonna take one more just like that, nice and slow, inhale. Exhale, rolling those hips up into that bridge. Once we're in that bridge, we're gonna pause right here. Keep your back nice and flat. We're gonna hinge your hips now down, tap the mat, right back up, squeeze at the top. Inhale down, exhale, we lift. Good, again, just waking up, firing up those glutes even more here. We wanna get that lower body nice and warm before we get into more complex coordination movements, full body movements, yeah? So it's really fired up here. Let's go for four more, inhale. Exhale, good, last three. Knees pressing forward for two. Great job, your last one. We're gonna lift those hips, hold it there. Just down an inch and up an inch to the hips. So just think a little bit of a hip pulse. Watch that we're not hyper extending and thrusting the hips up higher than neutral. Yeah, just a little lift, little lower here. Good, we have five like this. Press for four, breathing three. Last two, hold it up on one. Slowly roll the hips all the way back down. Good. From here, squeeze those legs tighter together, yeah? You got a $100 belt right between the inner thighs. Hold on to it. When you're ready, we're gonna roll the hips back up into your bridge. Holding here, we're gonna articulate those ankles. We're gonna lift the heels up, lower the heels down. Staying in that bridge, starting to get some movement through the ankle joint here. Again, really important when we get into our standing work later, that those ankles are mobile for us. Lift and lower for four here. Good, keep those hips up, three. That's it for two. Now keep your heels up high, do those little hip pulses again. Are we squeezing those inner thighs? Keep that activation there. Inner thighs, glutes, hamstrings, all working together. Little lifts, five, four, you got it. Lift three, up two, one more. Lower those heels, slowly roll the hips all the way back down. Good, shake out the legs. We're gonna take that into some single legs. So floating one knee up into a tabletop position, 90 degree angle. Start that articulation again, roll the hips up. Pause in your bridge, we're gonna tap those toes down, float it right back up, good. So finding the stability on that single leg here, stretch that thigh away from you. It's different than just tapping the toe down and up, yeah? Stretch the leg out and then right back up. Three more like this. Keep those hip bones straight up to the ceiling. Last time, hold it up in tabletop. Hinge your hips down again. Press and squeeze at the top, good, down. Exhale, lift, nice. If this is too much on that single leg, take it back to two feet, do that same thing. For three, press, good, for two. That's it, last time we lift, slowly roll the hips back down to your mat, good. Wiggle it out, we are switching legs here. One more set, other knee comes to tabletop. Inhale, exhale, tuck under, peel up. Right here, start those toe taps again, tap down. Float it up, yeah, so we're keeping that angle in the leg. Stretch the toes out. Feel that glute working hard, pushing down into your mat through that foot for three. That's it, keep it up, two. We got this, take one more. Holding that tabletop here, hinge. Down, press up, inhale, exhale. Again, focus back in on that breath. When we start to get tired, lean into your breath. Use those inhales. Use those exhales. Push for three. 
That's it for two. Nice work. Your last one. Slowly melt back down through the spine. Good. Hug those knees in toward the chest. Maybe rock side to side. Take a breath here. If you need a quick figure four, cross one leg over. Press that knee away from you. And then we'll switch sides. Good. We warmed up those glutes. We're going to go into a little bit of side kneeling work. So from here, rock and roll yourself on up. Coming up into a kneeling position, one knee goes down, other leg goes straight out on your mat. From here, you are tipping yourself over. Stack this shoulder over your wrist. Stack this hip over that knee. Lifting those shoulders up and back. Stack the hand on top of the hip. Flex that foot. Lift the leg up. Tap it right back down. Good. That's the movement. Lift and lower that leg. Now keep going with that. If we need to modify due to any shoulder or wrist sensitivities, you are coming down to this position right here. All right? So you have that option if you need it. Keep it going. We're still lifting and lowering. Don't stop here. Flex that foot back. Lift. Stay parallel. Feel that medial glute now really firing up. Lift for four. You got it, belly button in toward that spine. Last two here. Nice, you guys, keep it lifted on one. Do little lifts from there, up one inch. Maybe send that top arm to the ceiling. Reach energy out through those fingertips. Open the chest nice and proud. Lift for five, four, three, that's it. Two, last time, lower it back down. Good, sit back in that hip for a quick stretch. We're gonna come right back up onto that, stretching that top arm overhead, reaching that leg long, bend the knee and elbow in, reach it back out. Good. Try to fold the knee and elbow to meet right in front of that hip. Good. Inhale. Exhale. Stretch. Nice, you guys. Keep that moving. Reach through that heel. Four more like this. That foot stays flexed. Three. We got it. Reaching out for two. Good, this last one, hold it out. Give me those little lifts again here, up an inch. Long line through that side body, lift, lift. Here we go for five, four, you got it. Three, two, one more, and rest it back down. Good, little sit back in that hip. We have one more variation like that. Coming back up, stretch that leg long. This time we're gonna float it up. Reach that top hand forward. Can we reach to those fingertips? Forward and then back. They may not touch. That's okay. Get a nice big crease in that hip. Forward sweep. Squeeze it back. This one gets tougher. Keep breathing. We just have four like this. Reach and back. Here we go for three. Long leg. Breathing here. Two. That's it, give me one more. Stretch the leg back, hold it there. Little lifts, one more time. Five, four, that's it. Three, two, and one. Sit on back into that hip. Whew, that got nice and warm. All right, we're gonna keep working that same side. Come to an all fours position. Shoulders again over wrists, hips under or over knees. Extend that same leg back behind you. Lift it up, tap it down. Good. So when we lift that leg, what I don't want to see is this arching through that lower back. We're not working those glutes in that case. We're working an arch hyperextension through that lower back. Not what we're going for. Good. Squeeze in that booty. Lift. Long leg. Good. We just worked that medial glute. Now we're working the back side. That full glute all the way around. Four more like this. Can we push out of those hands? Create a longer neck. Hold it up on the next one. Give me those little pulses again here. Up, up, but stretch that knee super duper long. Hold it there, squeeze, squeeze. Belly button's up. That's it, keep it going. Five, four, three, two, one. Take it back down, good. All right, adding on to that. Stretch that leg out long. We're gonna create a little rainbow shape. You're gonna lift it up rainbow it, tap it to the side. Rainbow it, cross it back behind the opposite leg. Yeah, up and over, tap, up and over, tap. Good. Again, that long leg. Now notice, are we sitting into our opposite hip? Are we pulling up and out of that opposite hip? Keeping even weight through the hands. So many things to think about. 
keep breathing. Tap it side, tap it back. Give me three more here, reach for three. That's it, nice you guys, push here two. Beautiful, we're gonna keep it out to the side on this next one, hold it there. Lift and tap, lift and tap. Abs are working hard here in this position. Go for four and for three. Lift for two, one more, circle it back. Bring it all the way back in, sit back. Whew. Nice job. All right, we get to do all of that to the other side. Flip on around, we're gonna come back to that side position, kneeling. So reach that leg out long. Again, stack the shoulder over the wrist. Belly's in, right here, flex that foot, lift and tap, good. We know what it is now. So do those little self corrections here. Make sure your belly button's pulling in. What happens a lot is that rib cage kind of flares forward. Yeah, we wanna keep that in. Knit it nice and closed for four here. And three, maybe reach the top arm. Two, good, keep it lifted. Little pulses here, up an inch. We love those little pulses. That's where the burn comes from. Stick with it, we got four, three, two, one. Take it back down. You can reach back into that hip to give yourself a quick stretch. We're coming right back up in that position. Stretch the leg, stretch the arm, flex the foot, lift it up. Good, bend it in, reach it out. Nice, you guys, in, stretch it out. Don't be surprised if this second side fatigues a little quicker. It was still working on the first side, so it's a little tired. That's okay, doesn't mean it's weaker. It's working hard, three more, in, reach it out. You got it, two. Beautiful, your last one, stay out there. Little pulses up, up, good. Five, four, three, two, and one. Take it back down, Whew. All right, we got one more variation right here. That leg's gonna go back out. Reaching the arm forward if we can. Lift it up, flex, sweep it forward, sweep it back. Whew. Again, a big fold, a big crease in that hip. A nice big sweep. Lead with the toes forward, lead with the heel back. Just give me three more like that for three. You got it, right here for two. We're so close, take your last one, hold it back, little lifts up, five, four, three, two, and one. Good, we are shaking there, sitting on back. Whew. Nice job, you guys, coming back to all fours. Other leg here. If you need to, roll out the wrists or even take it down to the elbows, yeah? Feel free to take it here if those wrists need a little break. All right, stack the shoulders, stack the hips. Reach that same leg out, long neck lift. Tap it down, good. So this may be smaller than what you might think, right? Because it's not about how high the leg goes up. Yeah, we start adding in a little funky chicken there. We don't want that. Keep that in. Nice, now just keep breathing. Again, simple movement. Still feeling glutes, still feeling hamstrings. We got four. Keep it up here for three. Breathe here, last two. Good, we lift and hold. Little squeezes up and up. Nice, you guys. Not dumping in that lower back. Yeah, push out of the hands. We got five, four, three, Two, last time, take it back down. Good, hips back to heels. One more on this side, going back into that rainbow with that leg. Here we go, come back up, stretch the leg long. It's gonna lift, it's gonna circle out, tapping side, circle back, cross behind. Yeah, a big rainbow through that hip. And again, circle side, we tap, circle back and tap. Nice, you guys, keep that going. Reach the leg long. And we're breathing the whole way through. I'm gonna tell you that a million times because it's so important and we forget to breathe so often. Two more. Good, this last one, we're gonna stay out to the side. Keeping it there, we lift it up, tap it down. Lift, tap it down. I know that leg feels like a thousand pounds, but keep going. Four, and three. Last two, good, keep it up, sweep it back, and bring it on in, good. We can take one more child's pose here. 
open up the knees, sit back to the heels, crawl the fingertips forward, and take a deep breath. Yeah, let the hips just open here and relax into this shape for a second. Nice job. From here, coming back to all fours, flexing the toes underneath you, press the heels down, lift the hips up high. Take this down dog stretch for a moment. Open the shoulders to the toes, lift the heels up, lower the heels down. Good. We're about to take it into some standing work here next. Now that we're nice and warm through the lower body, we're gonna put those muscles to a little bit more work in some functional movement. Take three more here. Good, testing balance, coordination, all together and stability. Good, hold the heels down. Take that stretch. Nice job. All right, from here, we're going to step our right foot forward. Right foot fo comes forward into a lunge. Take a little stretch here for a second. Nice deep breaths. Beautiful. From here, we're gonna lift the hips back up. Feel a nice hamstring stretch. This is your last stretch, and then we're going back to work here. Here we go, bend into the front knee. Take your hands up to that thigh. Lift your chest, good. Right here, maybe hands come to prayer if we have the balance. Maybe they stay at the hips, wherever feels best for you. We're bending the back knee down and up. Now notice, as we go into these lunges, my front knee is not fully extending. Yeah, so it comes up, the back leg extends, the front knee stays bent, so that one's always working. Down, and then lift. Abs stay in, and we're breathing. Good, if we feel good balance-wise, maybe we take the arms forward, maybe they go overhead. We have lots of options to continually challenge ourselves here. All right, go for four like this, down and up. Woo. And three, nice you guys. Last two, good, now I want you to stay down there. Little pulses, both legs going together. Down an inch, up an inch for five, four, three, two. Last time, lift all the way up. Shake out those legs, nice job you guys. We're not done yet. Taking it back into that lunge position. Now again, that split stance, one leg forward, one leg back. Back heel is lifted. Bend back down into that lunge. Hold it there. Can your front heel lift? Lower, lift, lower. Good. It's a lot of balance, a lot of stability here. Lift, down, up. Give me four, four, three, three. Here we go, two. One more, set it down, hold it. Can your back knee bend another two inches? Hold it there, breathe. Maybe beach the arms up for three, for two. Last time, lift all the way up. Shake it out, nice job you guys. That was a nice good burn. We're gonna stay right here, turning out those hips, turning out the toes. Hands come back to the hips. We're going straight down, straight up. Down, squeeze the top. Yeah, it's a nice big wide turnout. Now watch the knees here. What happens often, those knees come in, yeah? Turn them out. Press the heels forward, dip the tailbone straight down, squeeze those glutes that we warmed up so much, and then inner thighs as well. Everything working. Breathe here, all the way down, all the way up. You got it. Feel free to take your hands, wherever feels best for you for balance, all right? Again, lots of options. Four, three, good, two. We're staying down there. Little pulses, one inch down. One inch up, good. Maybe reach the arms out. Reach out to the fingertips with energy there. Let those inner thighs burn out here. We got five, four, good. Three, two, last time. Stand it all the way up, Whew. shake it out. All right, we're gonna come back to this position in a minute. But we're gonna find your other side lunge. So twist those hips around, take the hands down. Find a little lunge stretch here first. Give that hip flexor a nice little stretch. And then we're gonna lift those hips up high, extending through that front leg. Feel a hamstring stretch here. Nice deep breath in. And then from here, we're gonna bend in that standing leg. Take your hands to the thigh. Lift your chest. Find your balance. Good, from here, your back knee bends up. 
down, lift, good. Again, find the stability here. Abs pulling in. Everything is working together. Down and up. We got another four. There we go, for three. Chest stays lifted, two. Stay down there, little pulses up and down. Standing leg, good. We want those legs burning. We want those legs shaking. Stick with me here. We got five, four, three, two. Last time, lift it up. Shake it out, you guys. We got one more to this side. Here we go. Swivel those hips around. Finding your balance again. Take it down. Standing heel. Lifts, lowers, lifts, lowers. Good. Up. It gets shaky right about now. I know. I'm feeling it too. Keep it up. And lift. Give me four. Go for four. That's it for three. Right here for two. One more. Lower it down. Sit an inch lower. Hold it right there. Let those legs shake. Hold it. Five, four, three, two, and one. Bring it back up. Pat it out. Nice, you guys. We're coming back to that wide squat position like we were just in. So toes are turned out. We're putting it all together now. So right here, hands come to prayer or hips. We're gonna take it down. Squat, swivel to one side, lunge. Come back to center. Squat, swivel, lunge. Good. Keep moving through that. You're going into a turned out wide squat and then a parallel lunge. Good, get that all moving together. Go at your own pace. You don't need to follow my pace exactly. Do what works for you. Just keep breathing. Just keep moving down. Bending both knees evenly in this movement, in the squats and the lunges. Inhale and exhale. Give me two more rounds. Down and down. Nice, you guys. Chest stays lifted, chest stays proud. One more round here, down and lunge. Good, down and lunge. Come back to center, hold that squat. Right here, one heel lifts, lowers. Other heel lifts, lowers. Those legs stay right where they are. We don't lift the head. Head stays where it is, just the heels. Good, up, down, up. Two more, each side, up and up. Good, keep it going. Lift and lift. Stay here. Sit an inch lower. Hold it. Love an isometric hold. They recruit more muscle fibers. Yeah, and we learn to shake and embrace that shake. Three and two and one. Stand it up. Nice, you guys. Wiggle it out. We got one more series here to go through. We're going to stay wide, but instead of turned out, turn your toes forward. We're going to take it into a side lunge from here, okay? So you're going to hinge at the hips. Side lunge, lift it up. Other side lunge, lift it up. Yeah, so allow your chest to go forward and sit your hips back in that position, all right? Abs stay in. Now again, we're feeling those glutes. Working hard. Breathe. Make sure that those knees are going forward over the toes. And again, down and down. Good, keep that going. You're gonna feel glutes, inner thighs working as well. Two more, each side. Breathe, breathe. Last ones here, down and down. Adding on, take it into a side lunge. Now stay low, cross over, lift it up. Reverse, side lunge, cross over. Lift it up. I call this one around the world. We're taking it all the way around and lift. Think of drawing a triangle across and lift. Good, down and cross and lift. It's so much fun to feel that burn happening in your legs. Feel that change happening in your body. Good, again, keep breathing. I want you to actively push out of that leg to stand yourself up. Yeah, it's not passive, super active. Fire up that glute and down and push. Two more rounds here. Keep it up, you guys. We got it in this together, nice and strong. One more each way. Beautiful, and lift. Last time here. Awesome, we're gonna stay down there, find that side lunge. Come up an inch, down an inch. Lift, lower, good, that heel is flat. That knee is forward. 
and then down and down. Four more here, four, three, that's it for two. Stay down there, cross it over. Other side, up an inch, down an inch, lift, lower, good, keep it there. How low can we take it here? I know we're tired, I know, I am too, I feel it, but stay with me. Yeah, this is when the change happens. We're in this together, I'm right there with you. Take three, and again, two. Last time, lift it all the way up. Send those arms out to the side, drop your chest forward. Good, relax forward into this stretch. Let your head fall. Hang nice and heavy, take some deep breaths here. Walk both of your hands over to one side. Draw your nose in toward the knee. Stay right here, option to bend your opposite knee down. Feel a nice good stretch in through that inner thigh. Hold it there. Lift back up, take it one more time, bend it down. Good. Lift back up, walk your hands over to the opposite foot, hold it there. Nose to knee. Good, bend that opposite knee down. Open the hip, lift it back up. One more time, bend it down. Good, lift it back up. We're gonna swivel those hips around, take it back into that lunge position. This time we're gonna drop that back knee, lifting our chest up. From here, this hip, I want to press forward into that stretch. Tuck that hip underneath you, feel a nice good hip flexor stretch. Whatever leg this is, if it's your right leg, take your right arm up, hold it there, maybe open the chest a little bit more. Good, hold that stretch, feel it all through the front of your hip. Should feel really nice. Take it back down into that lunge position. Lift the hips up high. Good, circle it around to the other side here. Back into your lunge, right on down, dropping that back knee, lifting your chest, hips tuck under. Same arm as back leg lifts up. Good, maybe adding in a little bit of upper back extension. Good, take a nice deep breath in. Exhale out, take those hands down to the floor. Pressing those hips up high once again, dropping the heels down to your mat. We're gonna hold this stretch. Notice in your body, are we feeling different than how we felt when we did it earlier? I know we're a little warmer, but do we feel like we can go deeper in this stretch, yeah? Really be aware of what you're feeling in your body throughout your workouts, where the changes are happening, how you feel afterward in comparison to your first initial stretch. Good, walk those hands and feet together. See if you can hold this forward fold stretch. Let the head fall. Now we're nice and warm, so let's get a little more length in the hamstrings. Grab behind the legs, draw your chest in closer to the thighs. Fold in half, let your head fall. Good, take a nice deep breath. Relax the hands down. Bend your right knee, sit into your left hip. Feel that deeper stretch to the left leg. Stretch your left arm up to the ceiling. Look at that left hand, hold that twist. Good, again, nice deep breath in. Exhale back down, switching sides. Bend your left, lengthen your right. Stretch the right arm up, big twist. Look at that hand. Nice job, take it all the way back down. Hang heavy one more time. Just let the head fall, let the lower back release. Again, just focus back in on your breath and your body. Grab the elbows. Give yourself a little ragdoll sway. Just gently side to side. Beautiful, let the hands fall back down. Bending the knees a little deeper, tuck the hips under. Slowly start to restack that spine. Rolling yourself all the way back up to standing. Once we get to standing, turn face front, feet are back underneath the hips. Take one more deep breath, scoop the arms all the way up. Exhale all the way down, nod the chin back forward. Rolling through your spine one last final time. Good, inhale, exhale, bend the knees. Slowly restack that spine all the way back up to standing. Roll 
rolling your shoulders up, back, and down. We made it, you guys. That was 30 minutes. Lower body. I hope you feel nice and warm. I hope your legs feel a little jelly, a little shaky. 